connecting the trail arm only and the sidearm throw. So a common pattern is that golfers will tend to stand up and really straighten that uh, trail arm. And there's a number of different things in play here. I could be struggling with my body creating too much power through early extension or kind of thrusting in towards the golf ball. Um, or I could feel like my right arm is really straightening um, early to apply force or to help get the club all the way down to the ground. So there's a number of different factors in play. Um, I find that the sidearm throw is a great way of feeling the engine and feeling like you're, you're not standing up on the way through, but then to add a little bit of a control element, we're going to do some single arm only shots. So the sidearm throw is basically where you put the driver even with your left foot and then you get in your golf posture and you do a little sidearm throw underneath the shaft and you'll you'll feel like your body is kind of bent over almost like you're looking underneath your arm well now what we're going to do is we're going to try and make contact with a single arm drill um, a single arm hit with the golf club um, i've got about a seven or eight iron that's a, a good place to start with this and then i'm going to use the same setup so i've got the driver basically even with my left foot and now i'm going to bring the club back and I'm just going to rotate through keeping my arm in front. And you'll see that when I make contact with this shot, it's much more of a body hit um, where it just feels like my arm is kind of being brought along, but on a different plane than I might be used to. I might be used to turning my shoulders very level, in which case I have to throw this down in order to get there. This is gonna feel like my arm and my body pivot are working more along the same angle. Now, one thing you want to be careful about is check your follow through position to make sure that the club is still out in front of your body. Um, what can happen is some golfers, when you've got this in your way, you'll tend to just kind of throw the arm. So now my body is facing the golf ball and you can see that I, I threw the arm across and the club finished way past my body over here. So I want to avoid that and make sure that I get into a good body position. So after I did one where I threw my arm, I threw my arm a little bit and caught that thin. So now we'll try to feel like we um, keep it a little bit more connected. That was probably the best one of that session. So since that was the best one, I'm going to take that club out of the way. And now I'm going to look back at the ball and I'm going to spend maybe 15, 20 seconds just kind of dialing in that position. So that right there is where I want to try to get to with my nine to threes and ultimately go through that position with my uh, three quarter 10 to twos and my full swing. So this is a great way for you to kind of combine a few of these feels of not early extending and hitting it more with the body on the way through into one playable feel. That playable feel may be something that you can really use to transfer your, your range swing and take it onto the course. If you like this video, then click the link in the description below and head over to golfsmartacademy.com for a free trial membership. It's free, you don't even have to put in your credit card. We have over 900 videos to help you diagnose and then train to improve your golf swing. Golf Smart Academy is the ultimate resource for do-it-yourself golfers.